Hey, Jason Moss here, and today I want to show you how to make a very simple, easy pop-up for your WordPress website. Okay, it's March 20th, 2020. We're in the middle of COVID-19, the whole coronavirus stuff that's going on. And I have a lot of clients and just a, a lot of different website owners that are looking to uh, display a simple pop-up, you know, that they can do easily. They don't have to hire someone to do it and show that you know put a message up there about COVID-19 that they're still open that they're taking the necessary precautions things like that so this is how you do it. it's very simple and this is for WordPress websites like I mentioned so what you're gonna do um, and this is what it looks like you're gonna have a banner at the top of the website it goes above your header alright and then when someone clicks on it alright you have your message that pops up okay very very simple there, there's nothing to this there's nothing complicated very simple so all you do is you log into your website okay once you're logged into your WordPress web, website you're gonna go to plugins okay you're gonna hit add new and actually what was the name of this plugin the plugin is called site announcements okay so you're gonna go to add new and you can just search site announcements now there are tons there's hundreds of different pop-up uh, excuse me plugins that do this that will accomplish the same goal it's just all of them are, are a little different okay this is by far the easiest one that I found to do to make it very simple there's like almost no settings to it whatsoever it's very simple so this is what it looks like. This is what you're looking for. Site announcements. I already have it active. If it's not active, you hit install now and then you hit activate. Okay, very simple. All right. So once you have that done, on the left hand side, you're going to see announcements. Okay. So when I click on that, you're going to have nothing in here to begin with. So you will hit add new. All right. And when you hit add new, you're going to have a window pop open that looks like this. Okay, yours will be blank. All right, so your title, okay, is what shows up right in here. Okay, so for the title, put whatever you want. All right, for this one, I put we are open for business, but please read uh, coronavirus announcement. You can put whatever you like in there. Um, that is just what I've chosen for that and then you paste your message inside of here okay now you can edit it however you want of course um, at the in the description of this video you will actually see a Google Docs link where I link you to this um, I have a Google Doc to where you can copy and paste this you can use it as your own you can you know change the company name um, this is primarily for home service based businesses where this verbiage makes sense. Um, obviously, if this doesn't make sense for your business, you're going to want to tweak it a little bit. Okay, uh, make sure you read it and make sure it applies to your business. Change the phone number, change the things that need to be changed. Once you're done, you're fine. All right, if you want it to be black with the white lettering, just leave it as is. Um, is it closable? Yes, I I don't think I would make it not closable uh, because that would be very annoying. Um, so always have that checked unless you have weird circumstances. All right. Um, link to URL. So if you maybe had a press release or a blog post which uh, speaks to your announcement, you can click on that and you can enter in like a blog post or a press release link. Um, to where when people click on it, it doesn't open the modal, okay? So the modal is this, all right? It opens the message in here. If you enter a URL, it's going to, when people click on it, it's just going to send them over to the URL. So that's completely up to you, all right, on how you want to do that. And you can play around with this, of course. If you really want it to stand out, you could like change the banner to yellow and then change the font, the text font, to maybe black. Um, when it's done, you also have duration options. Um, so you can always show it, hide for a day. Um, you can play around with that however you like. 
okay um, and then hit update if we hit update and then go back to our website and we refresh you'll notice now it's bright yellow with the black font that really stands out I'm probably gonna leave that and when people start scrolling on your website it stays it's sticky okay so it really makes sure people do click on it all right looks awesome very simple to do guys and this also works on mobile okay so it works perfectly on mobile it's not interfering with the website at all um, it's very very simple plugin that just simply works okay um, also like I said in the description below you will find the Google Doc let me pull it up here you're gonna see a Google Doc that goes to here all right um, this is a messaging kit that I'm handing out to all my clients at the moment so they have something simple to uh, get out to their customers all right so here you have the message that I copy and pasted there inside that plugin. Um, there's also like blog post stuff that you can edit and make your own. And this is kind of what the website pop up looks like. It's just uh, showing you an example. Um, there's even a video example of if you want to make a video, um, you know, that shows on your website or post it somewhere else, Facebook. This is a great video um, that really explains everything that's going on with COVID-19 at the moment. Um, he does a very, very good job. Places that you can use this, of course, website blog posts, Facebook posts, Twitter, Google My Business posts is very important because if people are searching for you, you want that showing up instantly. Um, the website pop-up, of course, an email blast, even a press release, okay? So there's many ways to get this message out, all right? But you can copy and paste this. You can use it as your own. Um, it is free for you to use as you wish, all right? But I hope that makes sense. I hope it helps. If you got questions, leave them below. I'm happy to help um, in any way I possibly can. Uh, we're all trying to get through this, um, you know, together, and uh, we all have to help each other out. So uh, leave a message if you have any questions. Thanks, guys.